Hi, I'm Damian Padilla. I'll be doing two monologues for you, the first of which is from Cymbeline, the second is from The Tempest. Well may you, sir, remember me at court, where I was taught of your chaste daughter the wide difference twixt amorous and villainous. Being thus quenched of hope, not longing, mine Italian brain, again in your duller Britain operate most vilely, for my vantage. Excellent. And, to be brief, my practice so prevailed that I returned with similar proof enough to make the noble Leonatus mad by wounding his belief in her renown with tokens, thus and thus, averting notes of chamber hanging, pictures of this, her bracelet, cunning how I got it. Nay, some marks of secret on her person that he could not but think her bond of chastity quite cracked. I, having taken the forfeit. Whereupon, methinks I see him now. Beat him enough. After a little time, I'll beat him too. Why, as I told thee, tis a custom in the afternoon for him to sleep. There thou mayest brain him. Having first seized his books, or with a log batter his skull, or punch him with a stake, or cut his wesen with thy knife. Remember first to possess his books, for without them he's but a sot as I am, nor hath not one spirit to command. They all do hate him as rootedly as I. He has brave utensils, for so he calls them, which when he has a house he'll deck with all. And that most deeply to consider is the beauty of his daughter. He himself calls her a non pariah. I've never seen a woman but only Sycorax, my dame, and she. But she is far surpasseth Sycorax, as greatest does least. Thanks for your consideration.